رو دیست کار دیست لوکیشن آف ده ای سی او سو ام گونه دو ده ای سی او اندن کام بک هلو ای بی وان ایز اکی اگن فرام مکیز گرش ویلکام تو انادر ویدیو ویدیو تو ده ایز فور انادر ای سی او کلونین از یکن سی اگا تو ای سی او هیر لیت می اجاس فیلیپ آور Yeah, as you can see, this is the actual uh, second-hand ECU from the Scorpio, and this is the genuine ECU from the car. Uh, those ECU is for uh, Ford Fiesta, one liter petrol engine, 2017. What we're going to do, we're going to try to get all the information from the genuine ECU and write it back to the clone ECU. So we're going to use again OBD Star today. So let's. We just turn the OBD star on and so from here we go to ECU flash we just say yes here and then we go to ECM and we just say enter and uh, just let me I just show you the ECU number those ECU is a is from Bosch company and this is the ECU number exactly same number so it's I just type the ECU number here as you can see uh, the actual ECU is MED 17.0.1 so what we're going to do we're going to go back to the OVDSR straight away we just go to the search and then we just type the ECU so we just type M M E D 17.0.1 as you can see this is the actual ECU we just we just, uh, we just click on it and then we just go for uh, pin out you need to use uh, adapter P003 you can use the other adapter as well but I got just this adapter let me just show you guys yeah this is the adapter P003 we need to use it so let's we say okay and uh, this is uh, just some information we go to the connector pinout and it's go that's all the pinout we need to do let's we do a uh, wiring pinout and i'll be back guys I don't know the wiring diagram as you can see here so let's we put the power on power is on now let's we go back to the OBDSR back and then we're gonna say connect okay trying to communication with the ECU yeah as you can see guys it's connecting now so that's all good as you can see everything is connected so now we're gonna read the EPRO All right, we just save this one as ORG. 
Okay. Okay. And now we're gonna beat the flash. Let's we save this one uh, uh, G. Uh, we just say okay, okay. So everything, uh, the actual EPROM and uh, flash data, the old uh, has been uh, read. So we're gonna disconnect from here. You just say yes so disconnect that I'm switching off the power or oh, now I'm gonna uh, get the actual uh, uh, clone ECU and just uh, uh, transfer all the wire into the clone ECU and then we can write back everything to the clone ECU so let me I do this and then I'll be back Oh guys, that's a genuine issue here. The second hand issue here, all the wiring is uh, connected to the second issue. So let's be put the power on. Power is on, as you can see. Let's go back to the OBDSR. We just say connect. Okay. So it's already connect. I'm gonna read the EPROM on the second hand uh, ECU as well, just for just in case if something goes wrong, we can have a, a backup file. Okay, from here we go to right April, just say okay, okay, and then we go to, this is the original April, as you can see that's the ECO number, we just say this one and then we just say okay, no, now it's just communicating to the ECO again. is right in the EPROM. the flash data okay okay and let's we see which one is a flash that one yeah that one is a flash I just say that one okay no now communicating to the ECU again
now I just uh, write in the original flash back to the donor ECU. That was very quick. As you can see, the flash data got successful. So from here, we just disconnect. Yes, everything disconnect. We just switch off the power and then just take off all the wiring pin out. And yeah, that's it, guys. Hope you guys enjoy the video. That was another ECO cloning uh, service uh, successful. I hope there is some information for someone. And like always, thank you very much for watching.